Hi, I'm Gene Douglas, and that's part of my freshman baseball team. Those boys are really working very hard. Say, maybe you'd like to meet some of them. Well, that's Billy. Uh, he's one of our biggest hitters. And there's Troy, our all-American colored boy. Let's be honest, he's the real reason we win every baseball game. And over there is Pete. Pete's just happy to be here. Good job, Pete. Make sure you study. All right, everyone, that's practice. Why don't you hit the shower? Boys, get in here. I'd like to talk to you about something very important. You might be noticing some changes going on in your body, or maybe some hair growing in places you thought you never had before. Coach, what's a blumpkin? Not till you're married, Billy. Every boy develops at his or her own pace. There's no right or wrong way to develop. Boy, baseball sure was fun today, huh? Gee whiz, you're right. Hey, what's wrong with your gross body? All the boys are starting to develop now at 14 and 15 years old. However, some boys tend to grow a little faster than others. Take Troy, for example. He certainly is filling out nicely, isn't he? Can anybody tell me what this is? That's a penis! Right you are, Billy. And who drew this because it's inappropriate for children of your age to be learning about penises? Now, some of you might be thinking about sexual intercourse, Troy. And some of you won't need to worry about that for a very, very long time, Pete. I have, a, I have a girlfriend. Each of us are different from the day we were born. Some of those differences can be very obvious. Take Billy over here. He's got a very normal body. A much normaler body than you, Pete. And then there's Troy. My God, is there Troy. You want to get a beer after this or something, Troy? Okay. Cool. Now, does anybody know what sperm is? Those are the ghost babies that live inside of your balls. Disgusting description, Billy, but you're right. Take a look at these, fellas. These are sperm. During sexual intercourse, the aroused penis will ejaculate into the female vagina. Once inside, the sperm will swim up into the female's uterus and fertilize the egg. No one quite knows what happens next, but ten months later, you've got yourself a baby. Does it all make sense now? Good, because I think you're all ready to become men. Coach? Yes, Pete? I don't have a penis. That's okay, Pete, because some boys do have penises, and some boys don't, and that's okay.